Hello gents, Adam here from uh, Air Rifle Tech. Um, I've, I've managed to um, get up to date with all my rifles over the Christmas period. Um, the last one being this uh, FX Wildcat in 2.2. Um, all, all of the internal work's been done, so tomorrow I'll just get an actually test and then that's ready to go out and shop. Um, so it, this gives me a little opportunity to um, do some work on my own rifles. Uh, this is my Air Arms S510. Um, I've had it for a few years now. Um, it's completely customised to my liking. Um, I've had a nice beautiful stock made, it fits me like a glove. Um, the barrel's been shortened, the, the shroud's been shortened, it's had a shorter cylinder, a quick valve and gauge on the ends. Um, it's had the, um, the shroud internals and adapters all changed. Um, so the regulator fitted, the whole hammer, valve, the reg, the, the hammer rail has all been um, tuned. It, it, it runs like an absolute dream. Um, this is a 177, it's running on JSB Heavies 10.2, um, and it comes out about 718, 719, so it's around 11, 11, 8, 11, 7, 9 foot pounds. Um, I'm getting um, 90 usable shots all at that power setting. Um, it's extremely accurate. I'd say it's under 10 mil groupings at 50 yards. Um, but um, I've got to a point that I can't really go any further with this rifle. Um, I don't really want to touch it to be honest with you, it's set up just right. Um, I am predominantly a hunter. Um, as nice as this is to shoot, sometimes it can be a little bit heavy on the arm, especially when you're going out for long um, shooting sessions, which brings me over to my FX Wildcat. Um, I, I wasn't too sure um, with the Wildcat when they first come out. I wanted to see what people thought of them, whether they was just a gimmick or you know if there was actually a good rifle. Um, I've had some good reviews um, come back, um, so I went out and bought, purchased one. Um, and believe it or not, before I actually um, fired a pellet through it, I took it all apart just to make sure it was all set up and and, and running as it should be. Um, it is a fantastic rifle. Um, uh, again, all of the internals have all been all been tuned, all been polished, all been set to, to my liking. Um, it, it's a very, very, very consistent rifle. Um, I've had over 100 shots and all through the chrono I was getting a, um, a spread of about three, maximum of three. Um, but there is one, one little niggle, one little drawback um, that I don't like about it, which is why I'm going to spend a little bit of time um, setting it back up. It loves super fields. It loves the normal JSB exacts. Um, it also likes the, the new day state heavies, which I think these are 10.3, 10.25. Um, it also it, it loves BZ Magnums, but it does not like JSB exacts, and these are my favourite pellet. Um, I find that the weight variation between them. Um, there's not a lot. Um, however, this rifle it just just does not like the heavies. Um, so I'm going to be taking it apart, having a good play with it inside, see if I can change anything. Um, I'm going to try um, up in the red pressure because this is set. I think it was about 57 bar, which is extremely low, which is why I'm getting a massive shot count. And again, consistency is spot on. Um, and it is accurate, but it just doesn't like the JSB. So I'm going to try increasing the reg pressure, playing about with a valve, and obviously balancing up the hammer to suit the valve as well, and just to see if we can get it to, to run on the heavies. Um, and, which brings me to... the FX Impact, um, which I'm sure you've all heard about. Um, they are a fantastic rifle. Um, this is a good friend of mine, Mike Taylor's. Um, he he's having a, an issue again. He can't seem to have his FX like in the heavies. It seems to like the um, I think he said it is the Air Arms, and it also likes the JSB Exact. But um, he, he's a hunter as well, and he likes his heavier 177. But this gun will, will just not shoot accurately in 177. Um, so I'm going to be doing a few videos. Uh, on both my Wildcat and on the Impact um, and keep updated to see how I get on with the findings.